Hello, I'm Cass Tate from Cass Tate Cards, and this is Nicola Streeton, graphic novelist and comics scholar. And together we edited The Inking Woman. Which we think, by the way, is we know will make a fabulous Christmas present or gift for any occasion, reasonably priced, widely available, a visual delight. I was um, producing postcards by a lot of feminist cartoonists. We were selling these to um, alternative bookshops all around the country. At the time, I thought it would be really fantastic to have an exhibition and a book um, to showcase the uh, talent that was on display in, um, from women cartoonists in Britain. What we discovered when we were researching the topic was just how many women cartoonists there'd been over the years. Right back to Mary Darley in the 18th century, who was the first caricaturist. She wrote a book about the caricatures. We hear so much about Hogarth, Gilray, Crookshank, Crookshank. We don't realise about Mary Darley. We don't really hear that, and yet she was the first to have published a book about caricatures. Yes, then, but we've, we found women going right back to the 19th century, the early 20th century, the, the um, suffragettes. Uh, right through to the modern day. Yeah, I was just going to add, and the first comics character was also produced by a woman, Mary Duval, and the sister pr uh, publication that is a lovely set for that bigger Christmas present is specifically on Mary Duval. What I also discovered doing the book was just how much work was being done now by women graphic novelists and comic artists. And this um, is again where I contributed. So I co-founded Ladies Do Comics in 2009 with artist Sarah Lightman. And uh, we've been platforming uh, women cartoonists and comics artists and people related to the field with more of a focus on the domestic and the autobiographical. This is a really great book and also to say we're making this talking to you on the day that it's been announced that Hannah Berry cartoonist has been awarded Comics Laureate. So she's in the book. Thank you.